Hi, I'm Philip Magnus. Welcome, I'm going to play some XCOM 2. It's going to be good, it's going to be bad. Well, spoilers, it's probably going to be a hell of a lot of fun, even without my commentary. Actually, my comments can make it pretty awful. But hey, enough of me. Let's go and see what XCOM 2 is all about. North Korea looks pretty good. Hey, get it? No, okay. To humanity, 12 new gene therapy clinics will be opening in select cities by the end of the new year. Despite the attempted attack by fringe elements, operations at the new facility in Paris thankfully remain unaffected. In response to the unprovoked intrusion on the eve of our most beloved celebration, the speaker reaches out to us. Christmas? Oh, it's Christmas. Tell me it's Christmas. Small number of dissidents again repeat the mistakes of the old world. Striking as we celebrate the benevolent savior who time and again offers only friendship and compassion. Yet these trivial actions could never break the bond between humanity and the elder. What a stylish looking alien sympathizer. Peacekeeping forces have all made several preemptive arrests of known collaborators. Advent again assures all citizens that today's celebrations will continue as planned. Perfect. The advent of Minotaurian reminds you to record all suspicious activity to your position. You were right. Definitely got their hands full today. Stay focused. Prep gate crasher. 60 seconds. I take my words back. Those alien collaborators and sympathizers are so nice. No. Signal received. Loud and clear. Love it. Okay, gate crasher. Your turn. Right, and this is where, supposedly, the fun part begins. But only is a tutorial, so everything that's going to happen has been heavily scripted. Worry not, the game itself, much, much better. First things first, you need to get out of sight. Grab some cover near that oh, wall. Oh, the water, look at the water, it's so pretty. I love water, water effects are the best. Well, grass effects are nice, too, I guess. In position. Yes, that but much is obvious. Here. It's better than nothing, but see if you can't find a safer position further out. Looks like full cover ahead. Moving out. Yep. So you see the difference between full cover Pressure and two. partial cover. Keep partial pace. cover is shown one. via a shield that is half full, while complete cover or full cover is assigned by a field shield. They're holding position. We're gonna have to go through them. Stay out of sight till we're ready to strike. Copy that. Keep to the shadows until you're absolutely set. We'll only get one shot at this. In the shadows. Consumment is interesting, honestly. 
probably because of the role reversal between humans and aliens that has transpired between XCOM Enemy Unknown and XCOM 2. Yeah, I quite like the idea and can't wait to explore it further. I should probably also mention that I'm not going to show you the entirety of XCOM 2, but I'm going to try and make a, a highlight reel of sorts, because after all, XCOM 2 is insanely lengthy, because it is a turn-based game, a strategy game, and those take a hell of a lot of time to play through. Not out of the woods yet. We need to take out those remaining soldiers. I've got the trap on them. Yes, you do. Engage. Do it. Ah, uh, the time has come to kill a little annoying <laughs> yellow-eyed person. Obviously not a person, yellow-blooded person. I meant. Obviously not a person at all. Hide little bumblebees. Mm, yes, all of that is obvious. Trust me. See you now. How about you all shoot first and celebrate later? No problem. Oh, honey, don't go there. I appreciate the bravery, but you're dangerously close right now. Be careful. I would probably. Nope. Have to attack. Annoying little thing. Oh yeah, helping me get my point You're across. Score, right? A tutorial has no freedom in it. Died in the tutor tutorial. Damn it! You can't just risk like that. Watch your flanks. So that's how you want to play it. The pool of okay. blood. Very detailed, really. Yes. Let's make him pay for his mistake. You killed my best friend. Prepare to die. And he did. Oh well. I'm sure his alien wife and alien child will not miss him at all. Alas, poor alien. I knew you. No, actually I didn't. Ouch. That kind of looks like it hurt. Central, reporting in. You're late. What have you been doing down there? Taking in the sights. Hey, hey. Heavily mutated are humans. Things? They're us. At least they used to be. Human hybrid soldiers. Advent's reward for obedience and service. We've all heard rumors. Bloody collaborators. No one wanted to. But we find what we're looking for today. I promise you that's gonna change. Let's move. Whatever may we be looking Looks for. Like that transmission went through. You have an advent transport. Probably someone who's murder. extremely handsome. Just rolling. We'll get back to that in a few moments, I'm sure. Just for the record, it's come on. Don't go insane, please. The yellow square is all about getting useful you loot from dead bodies. Yes, salvaging. Then we've got a scope. I don't suppose I need to spell out for you what a scope does, do I? It will be useful, I'm sure. I 
like... I really do like the model of the spaceship, airship. Hovercraft. Let's call it a hovercraft. Hovercraft sounds so much better than spaceship. Now I know we're in the right place. Well, I feel like one of you is dead. Oh, yes, I was right. What a surprise. Nope, have to attack again. See, this? No. Because I have to shoot the guy who is hiding behind a car and a bunch of crates. Because fuck logic. Hmm. What a surprise. What the? I'm going for the door. Ooh, look. Hacking. That's new. Didn't have hacking back in XCOM Enemy Unknown. Not even in XCOM Enemy with him. And I quite liked XCOM Enemy with him. What a surprise. There is. Good. Let's go. Right. Time to do we to secure the package. What exactly? Ah, secure the package. So there will be cargo. Who would give you intel about that kind of stuff anyway? I mean, we are practically in a world where all the reasonable humans have probably been exterminated or silenced by other measures. Honestly, I don't think that any alien sympathizer, collaborator, or an otherwise traitor to the human race would give me input about. Next time. Well. Whomever the guy in suit is. And I still think it's me. Let's get out of here. The commander. Possibly because I saw it already. But I guessed it before that, too. And you would have been very impressed if you had seen that footage. But no. Exploit had to be a little biatch and screw up the entire thing. And it was uh, so annoying. We're on the move. Yes, alien activity, please. No, I'll no. oh, say, please. I haven't been as sad as I am right now since that one time I ever did it with the... Huh. Oh, grenades! Lovely! Nope. Yep. Whoa! Those really are packing up quite the punch. I like it. Yes, I do. Time to run, run, run away. Almost there. Stay focused. I like the detail, by the way. Quite a lot of attention. And the game looks beautiful. Which is only to be expected from a AAA game in... Ooh, 2016. Careful little ponytail girl, Kelly. Yes, careful Kelly. We don't want you to be... Ow! That hurt. Can I shoot that guy? Right. Do a do a to you too, mate. Get us out of here. Let's be right. I will. Thank you. And I will indeed call the Sky Ranger. Because who wouldn't in circumstance such as this? You don't need to tell me twice. Come on now. Yes, yes, go. Come along. Home. Wherever that is. 
I'm fairly certain that home is no longer what it used to be. Because if I have to guess, all the old XCOM bases are truly and wonderfully dead. Exploded. Destroyed. And what's this? Well, it's probably an alien... Psionic robot? Sure. Who needs bodies, right? They're so 21st century. We are still in the 21st century, by the way, just 20 years after XCOM. Enemy unknown. Which is totally acceptable. I don't mind it. Save me, children. There's potentially decades of atrophy to contend with. Wish we had more time. I don't disagree. Familiar faces. Now, we risk losing the patient if we don't begin the removal procedure immediately. We are ready. Good. Let's get on with it. This guy does look like the engineer from XCOM. But doesn't look like he has aged 20 years. Just like 20 years ago. We were still calling it a war back then. Oh, so that's who you are. Awesome. We had no idea what was coming. Response from the cerebral cortex. Good. Prepping for cranial intrusion. Oh my. Hallucinations are never good. I've managed to identify the connection. Preparing to make final incision. These readings are getting really erratic. Of course they are. These implants were never designed to be removed. We are risking severe... No plan B here, people. Do it. Ah, memories from 20 years ago. Thankfully, the Eiffel Tower is not in fact destroyed. Oh my. No signal. Hello, friend. You look giant and, you know, friendly. Normal. Vital stabilizing. Procedure complete. Told him it would take more than that to keep you down. Welcome back, Commander. Good to be back. Um, um, no, I don't actually remember your name. Glad to see you're finally coming out of it. Don't envy the headache you must have, though. Still, can't fault Dr. Tigan. Is that one Especially of the games the where the protagonist is Easy. silent? We're yep. still not entirely sure what they did to you. That chip was buried halfway into your skull. Ouch. Lost a lot of good soldiers looking for you over the years. Almost gave up hope you were still out there. Acted on the intel as soon as I got word. You're a loyal soldier, son. I'm not sure what you remember, but uh, a lot's changed. Did the best I could, but the last 20 years have been tough without you. You uh, feel like catching up. Shen has the archive up and running on You do channel. as well as anyone can. Otherwise, I'd go see Dr. Tigan when you're ready. There's some things you should know. You'll be better at explaining them than me. It's damn good to have you back. Damn good to have me back too. You know, free from all those aliens. I suppose I should say, damn good to be back. Oh, so Commander, I can't. to the research labs. Can I click them? The archives? Okay, I will click the archives. Why not? Ooh. Let's see. Oh, so that's all about reading. I like reading. Right. Yes, reading. Probably should do it on my own time to. Anyway, I think I'm going to save, except that pressing escape does absolutely nothing. So I'm going to go to research. 
and see what happens. Hello, again. Impressive, isn't it? Capable of generating immense power, yet completely harmless to human life. If only the same could be said for the rest of the aliens' technology, Commander. Dr. Richard Teigen, Chief Science Officer. I am responsible for the entirety of our research here, as well as the procedure you so recently underwent. Welcome to my lab, such as it is. I am not sure what Central may have told you, but we found something while removing you from the alien stasis suit. A device implanted directly he had in a the occipital lobe. Does that mean that he had, had some sort of a device as well? To me during my tenure at Advent, I would already know the precise nature of its function. However, given time and your approval, of course, Commander, I Excellent. assume I will find out. Which brings to light an additional point. Though aspects of this facility are indeed impressive, I am but one man. Were you to direct additional support personnel and resources to me, I could substantially improve the speed of all our research. Hmm. A farewell, Commander. One thing hasn't changed. On your order, Commander. Bureaucrats I will, will begin researching the always chip for possible insights as to its function. Ask for more personnel. I'll see that work begins immediately, Commander. I'll contact you when I have a full report available. That research will keep Tigan busy for a while. In well, the meantime, you might want to head down to the armory. This looks bigger and better. Commander, hmm. to the armory. Yes, yes, I'm going, dear. Alright, let's go to the armory. Jane Kelly was instrumental in the op to get you back. She earned enough experience for a promotion. We should take care of that now. Awesome. My first promotion. I'm so excited. Hello, Kelly. The Ranger serves as our <gasps> primary reconnaissance unit, capable of moving independently in concealment while engaging enemies at close range. That's so awesome. Right. Hmm. Looks familiar enough. Your ability is slash attack enemies within movement range with your sword. Well, that sounds like fun. Actually, quite a lot like my type of gameplay. We're off to a good start. Our troops will only get stronger yeah. as they gain experience. So everything is locked. So I didn't actually have... Commander, to the bridge that much to do just now did i i heard you shen when we get the thing you'll be the first to know uh oh Detected. commander is it upsionic give me a second execute echelon protocol oh it's me attention senior command exchange confirmed i had wanted that to be a little more ceremonious but we've got something a local resistance cell just located this high. Let's not hang on, ceremony, old friend. Been pushing us to find. They tracked the device to a nearby Advent convoy and are attempting to take it down. If we can bring this converter back in one piece, we might actually get this place up and running, and give the aliens a real uh -oh. war for a change. A squad is prepped and ready to launch on your order, Commander. Just give the word. And I dare say, the word will be given once you press the button that points you to episode 2. Until next time, bye!